I think uh, going into the game, we felt really good about going just with our regular cadence, <clears throat> the clap. And, uh, you know, it was loud, louder than we expected, and you got to give a lot of credit to them. But, uh, you know, we, we went to the silent cadence kind of mid series, and that was always kind of a jumble. So, you know, once we got that, I think we got it rolling. And uh, at the start, I think our communication just wasn't right. And, uh, you know, there's, it was loud, and we weren't communicating well. And uh, a couple big plays we let, we let down, and it, you saw in the second half, we, we regrouped and kind of just called, just called ourselves down. Was that more of a strategic adjustment or just an attitude adjustment? Uh, both, you know, <clears throat> I think they were dialing up some really good blitzes that kind of messed with our pass protection. And we, we regrouped at half and uh, just really went over those. And uh, they were bringing it only to the right side the first the first half, and then they started bringing the second half. So, you know, we got the left side ready for it. And, uh, you know, just attitude, you know, no matter what happens, we're going to fight every single play, you know. And, and if you're playing the Ducks, you got to play a full 60 minutes. So we really just wanted to instill that in our team at the halftime. So, yeah. What's going through your mind there? <clears throat> I might say at halftime. Yeah. If you got to get some momentum going, you know, I think uh, we couldn't even get a first down. You know, we needed a first down to start the whole drive and get momentum, but just kept kicking ourselves in the foot and just, you know, it was a false start the first series and the crowd really got into that and we just kind of got down. You know, we left the defense out in the field for a long time and you can't you can't expect them to make that many plays on the field for the entire first half. So, I mean, we, it's a lot it's a lot on us. The leadership of the line, the leadership of the offense, just really. Uh, you know, we can't start that slow against any Pac-12 opponent because any Pac-12 opponent can play us hard. So. Was there any hangover at all from the win last week? I mean, it's sometimes tough for college teams yeah. to bounce back after huge wins you like know, that. I don't, I don't think so. I think it's just maybe you got to give a lot of credit to Wazoo's defense and how, uh, you know, I wouldn't say, you know, maybe different they are than other defenses in the Pac-12 mm -hmm. or, you know, they run, they run a lot of games. They run a lot of movement. They, they have the line calls they use. So I think that really shook us, you know. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, there's three guys on the offensive line who played Wazoo for the third year now, and we, we kind of expected it, you know. And uh, I don't know what happened. Maybe the atmosphere and stuff really got to us, you know. So I mean, I, I got to give the most credit to the Wazoo, to mm -hmm. student section, and, and it's crazy. So, Shane, when well, you guys pride yourselves on getting pushed in front of the walls, and all they do. Yeah. for them to hold you guys to the fewest yards, yeah. not only for you guys, but the fewest they've allowed in two years. Yeah. How hard is that going to be to swallow this week? It's, it's just pretty tough, you know. I mean, uh, we pride ourselves in running the football, and I think Wazoo just dialed it up really well and just really uh, keyed into our, you know, they keyed into our tight ends. You know, they, they started uh, vicing the tight ends, the looks, and pressing them. It really took them out of the game. And then uh, their movement really just took us off our double team, so it was really hard to get to the linebackers, and that was key for this game as we had to get to the linebackers, and we didn't do that. So I think that'll be one thing I see when we start watching film is that the, the movement really screwed with us first half. That series when you guys got to second and goal from, I think, the six, and you guys tried to run, or you guys ran it three times in a row. Yeah. It was, it was that just kind of exactly what you were just talking yeah. about there? Was, yeah, it was, you know, just being – their movement allowed us, they were just we were too thin on our double teams and allowed our linebackers just to run free, you know, and uh, you know, we were so we were so keyed in to go into the linebackers that we let the down guys go just because they're moving around and whipping around and get a chunk of him that they'd slip through. So you know, that's what that's that's what their defense prides themselves on is not letting us get to the linebackers. And I think they did a really good job of that. So you just gotta give them credit, man. I mean they dialed us up. So. I, I I imagine just because of the success you've had in that situation, especially last yeah. week, you guys were probably pretty confident with oh, yeah. the past. Yeah, series. you know, I think uh, red zone is really our thing. You know, we I don't we have a crazy completion, I don't know what it is, but we pride ourselves in the in the red zone. We have to score. And uh, you know, obviously that, that didn't happen tonight and we gotta just regroup and watch film and see what it really went down. So yeah. What was something you were proud of in the third, uh, third quarter? Guessing to move the ball pretty well. What was some of the things you were proud of? You know, it's just back to the thing that if you play the Ducks, you got to play a full 60 minutes. Just the fact that we haven't really been down this year like that, especially in the first half. You know, it reminded me of last year almost. And I think last year the team, it would have been 50 to zero. You know what I mean? Do we really rally the second half? Obviously, if we play like that the second half and the first half, it'd be a different ball game. I feel like so. You know, just our just our will to just never give up. So that's one of the positives we can take away. Thank you. I appreciate it, guys.